So. Most of you already know the story of how we began our life in the outdoors. If you want to see and hear that full story, check out episode 8 of the first season. After the death of my wife, I tried to help her, our 13-year-old daughter, build new memories. And so we begin our life in the outdoors. It started with camping, and then later on branched out into other things. We've been to so many places and done so many things and seen so much. Most of it I can't even remember. Ah, and there's a good reason to record everything. But as we close out this second year in season two, we've come to the conclusion of something that was only supposed to last for two years. And that was to crisscross America and hit every state in the union. Because once Hannah grew up and began to branch out on her life, the opportunity to do things like this will grow smaller and smaller. And so the question remains, it's been two years. What do we do now? Where do we go? And do we continue? When we started this channel two years ago, we had already been out in the outdoors for a while, at least five years. First camping, and then hiking in 2018, where we begin to learn a little bit more about the outdoor world around us, studying plants and trees and seeking out new trails anywhere and everywhere as we needed and wanted to escape the Bronx. As our tagline went, from the hood to the woods. We ended that year after muddling through and then trying to uh, record and hike at the same time by going across the country to New Mexico 
It was a really hard time for me because after so many years, I had slipped into a depressive state. And so that long drive was a difficult one. But who knew that going through Tennessee, going across to Texas, into New Mexico, spending time out there in the desert and coming back, that we would someday be living in Tennessee. It was as if the first season was about escaping the city and the second year, the second season was about fighting for mental health and mental strength. Throughout the years of hiking, Welcome back to every Society once in a while, Science. we have a third member with the us, and TK my grandson, who we call the Energizer. So, that's right. Guess who's gonna be riding with us Never so in a million years today. did I think there would be three generations of us hiking. It's been fun taking him along with us over these years, and I can't wait to take him backpacking with us. The last time we saw him was about three months before we moved to Tennessee. It finally became time to leave. For me personally, the year just got worse, and I spiraled down even more. Most of this was not made known during the Friday Night Adventures, though I did share part of our journey, because that was part of us even starting life in the outdoors. But December 22, I crashed and said, let's just go. It was something that TK wanted to do right after her mother died. But we never did. When we begin the Starting Over series, we left with big ideas and half a plan. We ended the series abruptly because, well, we weren't moving into our new apartment anytime soon. So we began to just focus on going back to the outdoors. With the pressures of looking for jobs, editing video took a back seat. And there's so much we have left that we haven't put out. A few days ago, we sat down and discussed would there be a third season? What would it look like and how could we make life here work for us so that we can do more of the things that we enjoy doing. So we thought about what the third season would look like. And here are a few of our favorite things. Along with the original season two opening and some video we have yet to share.
For season three, we discuss exploring caves and going back to this rock wall that we saw before. Hopefully getting back out west and this time to the upper states. Meeting the Van Strelin family. We've been talking about that one meeting each other for years. The Epic Family Road Trip is their channel. Hopefully some backpacking time with the three generations and hopefully and perhaps more time with our family in the outdoors. We want to thank you for your two years of loyalty, for your support, for your prayers, and riding along with us.